Real estate investing can be a profitable way to build wealth over the long term, but it's important to understand the tax implications of this investment strategy. Here are some things to keep in mind when it comes to real estate and taxes. Rental income is taxable. Rental income from investment properties is generally considered taxable income. This means you'll need to report this income on your tax return and pay taxes on it. However, you can deduct certain expenses related to rental properties, such as mortgage interest, property taxes, and repairs, which can reduce your taxable income. Depreciation can help reduce taxes. Depreciation is a tax deduction that allows you to recover the cost of an investment property over time. Essentially, you can deduct a portion of the property's value each year to account for its gradual wear and tear. This can help reduce your taxable income, but it's important to work with a tax professional to ensure that you're taking advantage of this deduction correctly. Capital gains taxes apply to sale. When you sell an investment property for profit, you'll generally need to pay capital gains taxes on the sale. This applies whether you've owned the property for a short period of time or for many years. However, there are ways to minimize the amount of taxes you'll owe on a property sale, such as by holding onto the property for at least a year to qualify for lower capital gains taxes. 1031 exchanges can defer taxes. A 1031 exchange is a way to defer capital gains tax on the sale of a property by reinvesting the proceeds into a similar property. This can be a valuable tool for real estate investors who want to avoid paying taxes on the sale and reinvest the proceeds into a new investment property. Passive losses may be limited. If you're a passive real estate investor, meaning you're not actively involved in the management of your investment properties, you may be subject to a passive activity loss rule. These rules limit the amount of passive losses you can deduct from your taxable income each year. However, if you're an active real estate investor who spends significant time managing your properties, you may be able to deduct more losses on your tax returns. Real Estate Investment Trusts Real Estate Investment Trusts, or REITs, have unique considerations. REITs are a popular way to invest in real estate without physically owning properties. However, they have unique tax considerations such as the mandatory annual distributions and potential limitations on the ability to deduct losses. It's important to understand these considerations before investing in a REIT. In conclusion, understanding the implications of real estate investing is essential for maximizing your return and avoiding costly mistakes. Now, by keeping these key considerations in mind, you can ensure that you're making informed decisions when it comes to investing in real estate. It's also important to work with a qualified tax professional who can help you navigate the complex tax rules that apply to real estate investing. With the right knowledge and guidance, you can make real estate investing one of the most profitable parts of your portfolio.